Hello everybody, my name is Phoenix Arc, and today I'm going to be showing you how to edit .cult files. Super simple, all you'll need is HXD. You'll get a, a portable HXD warning, that's fine, that's completely fine. Oh, wait, just select OK. Um, now, let's say you have your cult file right here. Now, what you're going to want to do is just drag that into HXD. Now, foliage, like trees and leaves and such, in the evergreen biome, with a blank top. Now, here's one that you'll likely be familiar with, foliage birch. That'll be like birch leaves or any other type of leaf in, um, in the birch biome. What you'll see here is the actual name of the color. There's way too many to actually name in the video, it's, but it's fairly simple. Water Frozen Ocean, Water Megataiga, Preview Megataiga. It's super simple. Now, what you'll want to be looking at is the dot right after as well as the next three bytes. This is going to be the hex code. Now, I can just start up paint.net since that's what I have. And you'll see it right here in hex. So, 54, 83, A5. And there you go, that is the hue that the leaves take on. A greenish, bluish, almost. Now, what you can do is, let's say I wanted to make this a deep red. Now, all you would need to do is select these bytes right here, manually, and paste that in. You've now edited the actual color. Now, all you would need to do is save that, open that up in your uh, Minecraft game, and check it out. Now you have a whole bunch of stuff here. You have particle colors, you have uh, like mob colors, you've got leash lights, you've got banners, you've got loads of stuff here to try out. I personally haven't tried all of it out but I'm sure you can have fun doing so. Now that that'll really be it. it that it's that simple it's it's just that easy that'll be all for today's video thank you all for watching hope you uh hope you all enjoyed it and have fun modding